welcome liberance i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for returning this is the business career reading for the month of august for you libra suns sun moon and rising sign business and career um this these are timeless reading whenever you pick them up it's a time that you're supposed to pick up this reading don't place a timestamp on this reading because these readings is for whenever you pick them up it was only done in the month of august so um liberals um what we're saying here is that some of you liberals are dealing with your boss or you're dealing with someone who has used their powers in the wrong way it could be you liberals that has done that and has transpired and bring in um some form of issues and i see your boss or uh, could be um looking at the situation so you liberal you liberals are definitely dealing with a boss or people in power um however this is happening and this is transpiring I see that whatever this issue and the situation is, a balance is going to be coming in. So you're beginning a month or leaving July with some issues um, with your boss. I see a transition is going to be coming in. I see the end is coming in to liberals who have been using their powers. Because if you are a boss or someone in a, a powerful position who have done um, who have created some destructiveness, I see. That is really debt and rebirth is coming in. So, as we move in the month, we have the energy of debt and rebirth. Now, this is coming up in the first week where something is going to be ending in your lives, okay? So, whatever that was happening and transpiring, definitely in this first week, something is definitely going to be ending in your lives, Whatever that has um, co-create and happen, I see that this transition is going to be ending. And I see um, some of you could, uh, your contract could be ending. So be aware of this because there's definitely some transition that is uh, coming up. Some of you could be changing jobs also. And I think you could be changing jobs and this is going to be where you're going to be being for the rest of uh, um for a, quite some time because um this a change of a position or change of job position is going to change so i see transition especially for you liberals who are in power or in a powerful position um some transition could be coming up it can be good or bad um if it is a positive transition it is going to be a position where um you're going to be in for a very long time in the second week, I see some falseness and some deceptiveness. And some of you could be ending the contract of a Aquarian, whoever this Aquarian is. Some of you are going to be finding out about some deceptive play at the workplace or in your business. And I see if it has to do anything with your business or at the workplace, I see they're going to finally bring some balance to this issue and the situation because I see Either people, higher ups is going to be standing um, up for um, standing up uh, to release some of you out of uh, this sort of a deceptive situation that was happening. Um, rest and uh, uh, um, reconsider. It is a month where I see a lot of rest and reconsideration is going to be happening and transpiring because I see a whole lot of issue that is transpiring and is happening for you liberals is where you need to find out and be on top of your game understanding what is transpiring at the workplace. So there is some form of deceptiveness um and whatever this form of deceptiveness is and whoever is doing it whether your manager or whether your manager has done it against you or whether someone who have used their powers against you i see this is coming to an end because i see higher ups is going to be coming in and is going to be releasing you or is going to be ending this form of deceptiveness that some of you liberals could be losing your job or some of you liberals who were worked against um whoever this person is um that is worth against you i see um some of you um a um aquarians um or a aries and aries and aquarians have done some form of deceptiveness together 
and I see they found out what they have done. So whatever that was happening and transpiring, I see definitely um, that there is a, a birth and rebirth that is coming up because they have found out some form of uh, deceptive play that an Aquarian and a Aries has done. And I see they're going to bring an end to these two people because they have seen some, some form of transgression of lying and deceiving um, that this Aries and this Aquarian has done. And I see people are going to be finding out the truth of what has happened and what has transpired. So then we're moving on and we're looking at the third week. The third week is going to be like one of the best, best time for you guys at the workplace. Um, this is going to be good because I see a lot of people are going to be um, showing you appreciation through um, showing you how much they um, really um, appreciate um, the job that you have been doing. Um, and I see some sort of a balance. If you were dealing with some issues on the work floor, some sort of a balance. Some of you need to watch your back because um, there is some sort of a destructive form that is coming up at you. But you have no reason to worry about this because uh, um, it's as if people are plotting. And uh, if you are plotting, you're going to be falling through the plot. If people are plotting against you, they're going to be falling in the plot. So be aware of this. So as we look, there is definitely going to be an end for an Aries and an Aquarian. Whoever and whatever these people have done, I see that they are going to be caught because people are seeing what they have been doing. So with a shutdown, a lot of managers is watching. Um, they're um, are supervising people and having a view on people computer to see if they're really working at home or wherever it is. So be aware of you. But in the third week is going to be a one of the most beautiful, beautiful week for you guys, because whatever the deceptiveness that was transpiring at the workplace or in your business is coming to an end because people are going to be finding out exactly what was happening. In the fourth week, it is a beautiful week. A lot of business is going to be coming in. If you have a business, the fourth week is going to be amazing um, because a lot of business. So your third week and your fourth week, whenever you pick up this reading, it's going to be very much um, amazing because especially business people are going to be getting a lot of uh, um, offers or a lot of, yeah, a lot of offers is going to be coming in. It is going to be a very fast, fast month um, for you guys, especially when you leave um, this horrible situation that is going to be transpiring in the second week. And when you leave that going in the fourth week, you're going to be realizing and seeing that you are overcoming some really deceptive play that people in power are basically or people who use their powers um whether your boss your supervisor that you're going to be coming out of this thing a lot of you they are going to be finding out that uh, um someone and this could be someone in um uh, and um an assessment bureau or that sort of a thing i've used some of you information and they are going to be um, coming down on the speaker, I see personal offices and that sort of a thing. It's looking at some form of deceptiveness. They could have received some messages and they're looking at it. And they're going to be finding out uh, um, where um, the discrepancy comes up uh, at the workplace. And especially the accounts department, the customer service, they're going to be on watch. Um, so a lot of them are going to be finding some deceptive play in the accounts department and customer service and sales. Okay, so you have customer service, but you have sales department. Um, there is going to be a lot of watch with people in these department because they are definitely seeing that some sort of a fraud um, could have been created or some sort of a false play could have created in these department. As we look at the outcomes uh, at this month, what you need to look forward to is that a lot of you is going to be finding out that there was some sort of a false spate that was created. And, and whoever and whatever has transpired, they're going to be coming and finding out the people who have been creating some sort of a false spate and some sort of an issue in order to 
access and uh, really um, upsetting some of you at the workplace or with your business because they're going to be targeting and seeing people who have basically um, created some sort of um, obstacles okay so this is going to be coming out and it's as if it is great you're going to be releasing from this chaos that was created around you either at the workplace or with other people you got to look out. Um, there is definitely going to be a transition and you got to look out because I see that some of your transition, a scorpion uh, boss could be making some huge transition. Um, you are standing and it depends on who you are um, because I see that some of you, if you're a supervisor or so, you're going to be getting rid of um, a um Aries I, I see you getting rid of this Aries I see that you realize that Aries has been creating a lot of uh, imbalance on the work floor and you're going to be definitely definitely getting rid of this Aries it's as if you're saying um okay so I've watched you you know created a lot of um issues around on the work floor and now it is time for me to make a decision about you and I see some of you or definitely going to be getting rid of an Aries. So now, whoever, a Scorpion, if some of you have a Scorpion boss, I see that they're going to be finding out that you have done some form of uh, um, the Seven of Swords is stealing something and trying to get away with it. But I see it's not going to happen because they're going to be realizing the deceptiveness and realizing um, what has transpired, how you liberants are connected with it, or you liberants could be showing up uh, a situation with an Aquarian and a Scorpion. Um, there is the situation where some of you are going to be bringing balance to a destructive deceptiveness that was created around you. And I see um, people are going to be coming in in order to bring some form of a balance uh, for this situation. So I see some of you are going to be Either starting your own business, this is the Ace of Cups, starting your own business, because um, the Ace of Cups is the energy of uh, you understanding um, that I am creating something that is uh, going to create my stability. It's as if you realize that this is what you were meant to do. Um, this, whatever it is, is as if you realize that this is uh, what I was meant to do. And I see that you are going to be definitely, definitely um, recreating some form of a wealth. So I see that definitely some of you are going to be starting your own business, something that you like to do, something that you enjoy doing. And I see you are going to be a huge, huge success. So this month for you guys is really looking good. Some of you could be on vacation, so rest and reconsider is coming up. But I see that as some of you get some rest and reconsideration and thinking about what it is that you want and how you want to move forward, I see you're going to be finding the right thing. Some of you are going to be thinking about starting your own business. If you do, this business is going to be creating a lot of financial stability for you and this is going to be good. This is a month where stability with your money, your finances, your wealth is going to be coming in and form. Some of you could be getting some form of management position. Um, so the you know, this is when people are going to be understanding that yes, the transition of me changing my job or creating a better process at my workplace has created a sort of abundancy. Some of you could have been realizing that you saw some form of uh, is, is deceptiveness that was created on the work floor and you definitely show up for people for what um, they were doing. So it's a very good month. Enjoy. Please remember that the weekly readings are coming out on uh, the 15th of the month. Um, you will receive the by readings. If you would like to see the extended of this reading, please use the link and go to my channel. Um, whenever you pick up this reading, these readings are timeless. Um, so don't put um, no form of timing because these are timeless. So if you have a question, you want to know something and this reading comes up in your timeline, that means um, this is the message um, and the answer to whatever you were asking. 
I gotta go. Please like and share these uh, videos. Namaste. Until next time. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's um, see.